we have to, in the end, go with what happened in proceedings that were supposed to shed light on those communications. And here, you don't have to actually re, you know, reinvent the wheel. You have the state courts, you have the state agencies, and you have the passage of time that shows us that there is no reason to believe that Ms. Ogletree would be of any danger to elementary school girls in your district. Her husband is a teacher here. Her family's from here. She lives here. She has roots here. She desires to be treated as innocent as you and I, given that in every situation she's been put to the test, that is how she has been judged. So when is she innocent enough? I submit that it is now, and that the refusal to let her volunteer is mere abstentionism, which my dad told me when I was a kid is just bailing out of the decision because you dug in. Um, all I can say is I think that decision has proved to be wise in some areas and unwise in others. In other words, a district should um, contest contract allegations against it. There's no question. And let that just play out. But this is a question of really, I would say, citizenship. Are you really a US citizen if you're unable to go walk into your child's school and volunteer? And if your whole community hears that you alone, of all the people here that, are, or that wish to volunteer, are not allowed to, it strikes me that that is quite a stain on someone and a very difficult way to live. There was a good way to take good care of Ms. Ogletree's reputation way back when. There was a way to give her notice of allegations, not let the feathers fly everywhere, but instead say, here, are the, here is the pillow of the rumors. Let's deal with it. Notice, hearing, ability to defend yourself. There was a way to take good care of the people who accused her of reputations. But instead, what happened was there was a rush to judgment. We're still living with it now. There's no need for it. And all I would ask you is that in your wise discretion, without any compulsion to do so, without massaging of legal mammals, and, and, and without any sort of uh, defensiveness to say, yes, we'll fight you on contract. We don't agree we're discriminating against you. We don't agree that there's anything wrong in terms of a lawsuit. And we don't have to do it. But we would we actually say to you, in this small area, we can make peace with you. We we can see how <clears throat> you discharge this responsibility. And we would like to welcome you back into the community in that small sense. Thank you.